Sims just had its biggest update yet, in my opinion. What's up, boo? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the dark side because today, this video is all about the new features to the base game of The Sims 4. Now, if you don't know what that means, it means all these features are free and they're in the base game, which means you don't need any additional packs or whatever in order to access these features. And we'll be going through all the ones that I know about. Hi, if you don't know who I am, my name is Troy. I do a lot of Sims 4 mod videos on the channel and I occasionally do the reviews and updates here and there. So that's what we're doing today. Let's go ahead and just jump right in. All right, so I'm gonna start off with cast first and then go into the gameplay. There are chapter markers. You wanna click on them and go wherever you want to go. But the first thing I wanna see, which has been on my mind since the beginning of time is the new eyelashes now i think they're under skin details i actually don't know okay i found them they're under makeup and they're gonna be under eyelashes okay so we get two new eyelashes okay you know what this is my favorite this is my favorite here i will say that this one can i go into details let me see okay i don't know what it is i think it's the it's the lines of it they're one they're very thick i feel like they took the original strips and then they just elong like elongated it and then added the little you know whips on the side from far back they look fine but when i'm up close i don't really like it but this one is my favorite. I think because it's not too heavy. Yeah, it's not too heavy. I think we get more in the pack for Love Strap, but we get these new in-game ones. At least we're getting eyelashes. Now, I wonder if they'll add more in the future. So let's move on to the next thing, which we are in the more details panel. So this panel here that gives you gender and sexual orientation. We have the new romantic boundaries. Now I'm going to turn off my G-shade so we can, you know, see it clearly. And we have one, two, three, four, four new options. So this says the Sims feels jealous if any romantic partner engages in non-physical romance with other Sims. Then we have this Sim feels jealous if any romantic partner engages in physical romance, excluding woohoo with other Sims. Physical romance, is, he says excluding woohoo. So I'm guessing like kissing, hugging, embracing perhaps. Uh, this Sim feels jealous if any romantic partner engages in woohoo with other Sims. Yes, this Sims' jealousy triggers can change by talking about it with other sims yes so you can put no if no this sim is firm on their romantic boundaries and cannot be asked to reconsider them Ooh. okay so i'm guessing no for all that means for the engaging in woohoo they may have a minor reaction or no reaction depending on personality trait for the this sims feel jealous if any romantic partner engages in physical romance if you click no they may have a minor reaction or no reaction depending on personality okay cool i guess this is their answer to having more dynamic ro romantic because you know sometimes when your sims you know when they're they stray from the relationship it's like okay i'm mad this instant but it's like i'm gonna be mad for a good minute or you know they really just don't care there really wasn't anything besides the woohoo partners that dictated if your sims actually had like a long lasting effect when they stray from the relationship okay let's go into the relationship panel and now everything's a bit more inclusive especially when it says partner so you have father brother spouse engage and partner but you also have the new engage and partner so those two are added so instead of saying husband or wife it says partner and engaged which i think a lot of people were asking for engage in the game all right so the biggest headache in the sims is gone apparently and that is the ability to apply all when you're doing outfits accessories to the game to your sims is different outfits so let's do that real quick so i want to go into let's go into the accessories real quick accessories that she has on these earrings and this necklace now that's not the same with the other outfits let's choose the hot wear so let's take apply accessories to hot weather cold weather and sleep boom oh and it did a little animation did you see that but now the hot weather cold weather well you can't really see because of that but sleepwear wait where did i put it i thought i said sleep or did you just ignore me you probably ignore me and i hate you for that so let's go here oh okay so it depends on where you're clicking so you can also apply full body so let's do let's apply the full body oh wait you can't do that here maybe here okay now you can do it. apply tops to hot weather and it did it boom it's there now i guess because we didn't really have anything on the bottom 
let's change the top again let's change to this and then let's change oh i don't even know what i just took off let's just do something random okay so let's take this and then let's apply to hot weather again and then boom you do apply bottoms uh, oh oh if you click here it automatically applies everything to the bottom wherever you're choosing oh i see i see i see okay shoes click it now all the shoes are here oh, okay cool okay i like that once you get the hang of it it's not that confusing but you will have to like pay attention to what you're currently highlighted on so that way you don't click on something you don't really want to click on if that makes any sense okay oh Oh, okay let me know in the comments below are we happy with this i feel like the only thing i would probably do it for it which again is the accessories maybe the hair which i believe we do have some new hair if i'm not mistaken i wish when you first boot up like it does for the pack it shows you anything new but it also shows you anything new in the update i wish it did it think there is it's like a short style if i'm not mistaken it's like a short style there's new locks and there is a ponytail for the men is this it this looks like it right am i dripping applied all boom now she has the same hair throughout let's move to the guy no there's one over here all right so hair oh god now i have to find the ponytail here are the locks Ooh, they're nice kind of wish the sims hair when they have you know they're like down the neck they move to because it's so weird when they you know when he moves his head and they're, they got this little indention that's just for all hairs like i wish there are some hair physics. I think there is an ombre version as well. There is an ombre version. Here it is. Yeah, here is the ombre. All right, we also get some new nails. So let's go to fingernails. I think it's the coffin shape is what it is. I'm more of a stiletto pointed personally. Let me know in the comments below. What is your go-to nail style if you get nails? I think this is it is this the coffin I think so again i i really 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 wish with all my heart that they would tell us exactly which one is new like just say new okay we also got the ombre or like the french tip Ooh, those are pretty i'm more of a i am i'm i'm pretty sure i'm more of a french tip my per, myself personally well like the pink stud that's my go-to i don't have anything else to say about nails that was all the new features for cast so let me know in the comments below what you think of the new cast stuff but let's go into game builders rejoice because there are curved pools now in the sims 4 so we have well rounded if you know that makes more sense so we have the rounded pool the rounded pool large and then the rounded pool extra large the first thing i'm gonna make is the heart can i can I make a heart? I think I can make a heart. Okay, let me see if I can do it. Uh, I think I've already messed it up. Mm. Ayo. I want to make a heart, right? Or did I just mess it up? I think I just messed it up. Listen, don't, don't say nothing, okay? I'm not a builder. I don't know how to build like that. You can, ooh, ooh, you know what you could do right here? A little seating area, that'll be cute. So, okay, I did that. Let me see. Boom. Another seated area, perhaps. And see, I saw it on a TikTok. And I was like, and they, this was before they had the rounded edges. But I was like, I wanted to make the heart. They won't let me. They won't let me be great. They won't let me be great. I wonder if I do this. And then maybe I do this. Aw, I can't check. I can't. Okay, now I did it. You know how some of those resorts, they have like all these giant pools and they're interconnected? Oh, you can connect it there. Huh. Maybe if I do it here, do it there. Boom. That's a very narrow passageway for a sim to travel, but I don't think it'll be safe. But did it. Kind of, sort of. I don't know what I'm doing. But yeah, curve pools are not on the sims. Period. All right, let's go into game and let's check out some of the new game phase gameplay features all right so gameplay did get an update itself and one of the new features is the ability to hide relationships which you can normally do this or delete them when you have ui cheats which is a mod but now when you left click on a sim it'll say hide relationship and then it will ask you are you sure you want to hide the relationship between kylie love and who you know so and so this sim will no longer appear in the relationship panel but the relationship will remain unchanged a hidden sim will reappear in the relationship panel if your sim interacts with them this is basically ghosting someone i think you know like i don't want to see you i don't want to hear from you do not step up to me but the way the sims acts i feel like do dolly whatever their name is will reappear by the end of the week so you click yes they're gone and yeah now i'm gonna invite oh i have nobody to invite over i need to find a new sim i should have did that before 
for i wasn't really planning but now oh okay judas wait can i even talk to judas she's a global superstar and she's just walking down the street i need celebrities to act like celebrities in my opinion angel let's do friendly introduction i had my g-shade off the entire time why didn't you tell me i'm gonna run on over so the interactions also got an update and there is the new relationships high menu so you can view relationship, you can ask my romantic interest, ask my woohoo interest, ask a single and other sims. You don't really need to know them that well for this to pop up. But you know, when you're going through like romance and flirtation, all that stuff, like the interactions in The Sims 4 have gotten so, I want to say, so I want to say big, cause I like, that's not the word I want to say, but so jam packed with stuff. When you're looking through things, if you don't have the mod from Twist and Maxi that allows you to type in what you want to search, it becomes a headache when you're trying to like get relationship stuff. So I think I need to view, okay, view relationship. Of course that pops up. And then relationship, uh, ask a single. And reading the patch notes, if you have more packs, then those interactions will also appear. So become best friends or join household. Anything that deals with relationships will appear in this panel as an easier way to get to things. So just a quick FYI. All right, so the relationship panel at the top of the screen when you're talking to Sims also got a facelift. So if you click down here, you can see that they're energized you can see uh sentiments about them you can also see there's a pleasant conversation which you know kind of tracks because i did ask if they were single and i just met them and clearly she's not all right you know what let me just move on okay all right so we're gonna go into manage worlds for the last thing which is the neighborhood stories there are some new adjustments to it so if you click on this icon here and then there's romantic changes sims may start romance and either nurture or damage the relationship or friendship changes sims may make friends on either nurture or damage relationships so this is you know new additions to romance because clearly there wasn't any there sims could join a career they could move out they could leave a career they could die in accidents rescue horses adopt like all the things so these are the two new ones and i'm sorry i i did not have it enabled but now it's enabled but those are the new additions to the sims 4 base game let me know in the comments below what you think of them but that is the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already if you made it to the the end put a check mark a green check mark and i will see you next time bye